everyone watching on YouTube and welcome back to more Near Automata. Let's load up the game. I have no memory at all of what happened last time. Don't know what we need to do this time, but we'll work it out one way or another. Start the game. So in chat before, we were talking a little bit, for those of you on YouTube, we're talking a little bit. I have an emote on Twitch where it's three swords from three of my favorite characters. It's a Gaius' sword from Tales of Zillia, the two become one Keyblade from Roxas from Kingdom Hearts. And then uh, the level 2 Monado from Xenoblade Chronicles. And Nero has told me that uh, that Monado specifically is evil, and I highly disagree. The evil Monado is the form it takes when Zanza has it. When, uh, when Dunban and Shulk are using the Monado, it's in the hands of a good guy, therefore it's good. It's not the weapon itself that is evil, it's the user. So I highly disagree with your take that... Uh, the Monado until it becomes the true Monado is evil, because it's not. No weapon is inherently evil like that. What on earth do we need to do? I do not remember. I accidentally just shot the transport thing. Good job, me. Good job. I can't look at the map unless I'm back on the planet. All right, all right. Transport me to... Uh, transport me literally anywhere so I can see the mission markers come up, I guess. Yeah, see, most of chat agrees with me. It's not the weapon that is evil, it's the person using it. I'm sure that there are some exceptions where it's like, well, there's this one sword in this one franchise where the sword itself has a soul and is evil, or is good in some way. Yeah, sure, you know, there are exceptions to every rule. But for the most part, it's, uh... the person that decides if something is evil or good or not. Decides if a weapon is, at least, I mean. All right, so we gotta talk to Pascal for the main mission. Yeah, I accidentally just like chopped nines in half. Good thing that he doesn't believe in being hurt. The Yorha Betrayers should spawn now, is what I was told by chat, or at least it's likely that they will now. What is this? The Wandering Couple. Okay, so I need to go back there as well. Uh, That's the, yeah, the Lord of the Valley. We're not doing that until way later. Camp development. Main mission is there, Lost Girl, okay. Unknown mission right there I need to get a hold of. And then I still haven't done all the stamps. We're going to get these stamps done today. This mission as well, I was told to hold off on this mission because it's difficult, but might do that today, depending. I do all side quests you can feasibly do at your current level. Next main mission locks you out of a few side quests. Thank you for the heads up, Lone Wolf. I'm really worried about some of these red markers that I can't tell how to get to them. If it's something like, oh no, you should definitely be able to get to it and you should do that now. Or else you miss it. Because I just cannot tell. Alright, well let's do, uh, let's try and do the Yorha Betrayers. And knock that out. What about Arglis though? Is that Zanza being evil then? Were you trying to say... Ar Arglis is the name of the giant that Zanza possesses the body of, right? Arglis is not an evil person. He, w from what, uh, from what Egil, Egil, how do you pronounce this? It's Egil, right? You pronounce it Egil. From what Egil told us of Arglis, Arglis was a really good guy. He was a really cool dude. But Zanza is the one that possessed him and made him evil. Because it, at that point it wasn't Arglis, it was Zanza. So no, Arglis is not evil, Zanza is evil. Get on that. There you go. Two red dots in that factory area are access points. Thank you for reassuring me. Betrayers, are you here? Come face me, you cowards. I want to fight you. Alright. Nothing there. On to the next spot. Hopefully they spawn. The heck is this guy doing here, huh? Hey! What do you think you're doing there? What level are you? I can't tell. A oh, level 26. Okay, I can beat a level 26. Should be good experience, actually. Come here. Ah, yep, blew that up. You don't need that, do you? None of that. Can't touch this. You cannot possibly... Oh, there are little guys here, too. You cannot possibly fathom the level of power that I hold, you foolish fool. Ah, oh, yeah, there goes that arm. Are you dead? You look dead. Yeah, you dead. Easy experience gain. We're about to level up again. Nice. Give me those materials. I need the money more than anything. Okay. 
That should be everything we need to repair the machine. Ah, oh, sick. I didn't even know that I needed that. Doesn't look like they're here either, which means we have to go up top, I think. Yeah, I know you can get Sataniel and Persona 5 NG+. Plus. I'm trying to get the Platinum, so I'm gonna... I'm going to get every single Persona in the game to get the Platinum. What the heck was that? Whatever. Alright, we gotta get up there. Oh, hi there. What level are you guys? 16, you know? Not really worth my time, I'd say, but I'm already in the process of killing you. This guy's level 20. That's a little bit better. I love double sword mode. Give me that critical up. I'm gonna sell that eventually. Goodbye to you. Come on. Bum, 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 bum. Ooh, hello. Get up there. Up there again. Alright. Hopefully these stupid betrayers spawn up here. This is the right way, isn't it? I think it is. Yeah, I see it coming up on the map. I'm gonna leave these robots alive because I want to hurry up. Please, oh please, spawn here. I beg of you. I don't know what else to do. I'm not seeing anything. Unless they're, they're from your huh? Alert. Targets are rogue units 22B and 64B, currently designated for detention. Um They've come for us, idiot! Prepare to engage and inform the captain! Uh got it! Final currently wanted by command for desertion. Disengage and surrender immediately. Shut your trap! No, I refuse. Come here, you foolish fools. Oh dear, okay, they're strong. They aren't doing the teleport thing, though, and that is why they will die. Calm down there. Alright, this is uh this is an opportunity where I need to be using uh all of my button pressing abilities. Laser! You foolish fools do not possess pods. There's no way you can possibly overcome me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Be easy there. No need to get so serious. Yeah, I'm the almighty 2B. You can't possibly win. Hey, come back here! You coward. They got away. Less than ideal. We gonna get a message or something about that? Do, do, do. Don't touch me. All right, sorry. I was trying to look at chat. Let's go over here and do whatever this is. We didn't get any message about the betrayers after that, but... Uh, do I need to be up top? I think I need to be up top. Oh, here we go. I don't know what this mission is, but let's knock it out. Ah! That was almost bad. And by bad, I mean not really, but it would have been slightly annoying. Over here? This is where I picked up all my lost weapons and stuff before. Oh, that's an invisible wall. There's another Yorho Betrayer Circle. Alright, we'll go to that soon. I wanted to knock out this mission while we were here. I don't know what I'm doing, though. It said Wandering Coupler or something like that. Hello, is anyone here? I'd like to talk with you. What mission do I need to do here? Hold up. Map mode. Oh, what the heck? Oh, it's a Betrayers again. And Machine Examination too, of course. That also says Betrayers still. What is what is this mission? Take, take that away. This is called the Wandering Couple. What do I need to do for this? Wandering Couple. Right there. Been an android couple who fled from the resistance side of Pascal's village. They had poor violence and only wish to live in peace. Go to the abandoned factory to collect the following item in order to perform maintenance on the male android, the elaborate Gadget 01. Alright, so I'm trying to find an item. I understand now. Is it this? Nope. Need to find an elaborate gadget. So there's going to be a spot around here somewhere, I assume, where an item is lying on the ground and I can pick it up and that's what I need. Ah, uh, right here? 
Nope, that's iron ore. That ain't gonna help. Maybe it's in this chest. Is that possible? No, no, it's not. Well, it might be possible, but not in that instance. I hope it doesn't mean that I just need to go into the factory and find it. Normally, it would always be inside of this little circle area. We met my fire to L2, pod to R1, and lock on to R1. Feels so much better and more comfortable pressing things. Sounds like a good idea, but also sounds like a lot of work. Wish the red circles were like the yellow ones in Xenoblade Chronicles X, where they brighten when you're on the right level of elevation. That would be sick. It's a really good call. I agree. Is it this, possibly? I feel like I'm a little too out of the circle right now, but maybe. Still no. Where on earth is this material I need? I'm worried that there's like one spot that I can jump to that I don't realize I can jump to, and that's where it is. Oh, please. He's done it. There we go. All right. That wasn't too bad. Now, we go back out after the betrayers. I was thinking of fast traveling, but, you know, we'll just run it. We'll just make the run. All right. See you later, Stan. Thanks for dropping by, dude. Bum, 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 bum. All right, you filthy betrayers. Where are you? I'm going to beat you up with my sick katana. You will stand no chance before my power. Hey, kill these things as warm-up. And also because I need all the experience I can get. How dare you have a shield? That's against the rules. You're not allowed to do that. Die. Die, all of you. Easy murder. Easy money and experience gain. We so close to a level up, boys. Hopefully finishing a lot of side quests today will get us a lot of level boosts. I gotta get up high enough to where I can beat that stupid whatchamacallit. Whatever it was, that level 50 thing. The Lord of the Valley, that's what it was. Or that's what the mission was called, at least. I wish instead of showing me... I'm pretty sure it's showing me the number of total experience I have in the game. I would much prefer if it, like, showed me how many experience points I needed to level up. That would be much preferred. Really, any, like, level growing system besides that, I'm not a fan of. I just want a solid number that is like, get to this number and you level up. All right, let's do this real quick. 53 minutes later. Let's see what we've got. My name is Engels, serial number 110-B. Okay, I did not expect this. Whoa! I was manufactured in February of the human calendar year 11,934 AD. Wow. My first deployment was in August of that same year. Requesting confirmation of current status. This thing's getting chattier. Requesting confirmation of current status. Uh, well, you were defeated by us androids. Androids, words. That's why you can't move. At this point, you should probably just hand over any classified information in your possession. Understood. Alright, sick. Ooh, level 25, let's go. 5,000 gold and 750 experience? I love that. That was surprisingly easy. My mission has already been accomplished. My commander is absent. I have no orders to withhold classified information. But as a combat weapon, I do not possess a great deal of data. You should not expect much. We'll keep that in mind. Yo, I like Engel. Cool dude. Engels, whatever. I am tired, I must rest. Alright, sweet dreams, dude. Thank you for saving me. That's not quite what's happening here. Please visit me again. Why? Because I have nothing to do. What? <laughs> Good point. Are you trying to say you're bored? I will come back to visit you, but first I'm gonna climb up on your what a back. Strange machine. Strange indeed. Don't ever interrupt me again, Nines. First I'm gonna climb up on your back and see if I have to do battle up here. I may need to beat some people up on top of you. Just let me check real quick. Ah, right, yep. Targets are rogue units 22B and 64B, currently designated for detention. Damn it! I'll kill you! 
You'll try. Come here, you. I am the almighty 2B. You cannot stop me. Oh, look at you. You're already almost dead. Circle. Wait, why did the circle... Why, what the heck is with the circle popping up? Whatever. I'm just gonna kill you. Easy hit. Whoa, calm down there, bud. It's not that serious. Oh, circle? How could you? That was awesome. Yeah, give me all of that. Alright, circle is a sick, like, reaction command of ultimate damage. Big fan of that. Circle, gotcha. Were you not weak enough to die there or something? Oh, you're done anyways. All that money. Oh, hi. 2-2-B. 6-4-B. What the hell? Alert. Target is former Yorha Captain 8-B. Currently wanted for desertion. Proposal. Disable and detain at once. You... You did this! Please! You have to stop fighting! Shut up! You don't know anything! <clears throat> Analysis. Unit 8B specializes in close quarters combat. Proposal. Destroy enemy with long range attacks. Destroy? What happened to detain? Yeah, I'm way ahead of you. Alright, I immediately, upon saying that, uh, ignored your advice and went straight in. Ah, oh, circle! Alright, that was a little weird. Ow! Calm down there. Not that serious. You're only level 20, you don't stand a chance. I'm level 25, girl, what are you gonna do? I don't know if that's doing anything. Kinda hard to tell. Calm down there. Circle again, got him. Alright. I mean, it looks cool. I don't really know if it's accomplishing much. Do I need to press another button when that happens or something? Can't touch this. I'm too good for you. Laser. Get in there and press circle. Nope, stop that. Stop, I said. I want to press circle to defeat you. Alright, you know what? Goodbye. Oh, circle. Got him. I have no idea what just happened. You're as good as done, bud. Laser. 10,000 gold and 400 experience. I'll take that. And type 40 Lance. All units destroyed. Black box signals confirmed offline. Mission complete. We killed them. Our fellow units. Why the hell did they steal from the resistance in the first place? You think Anemone might know something to be? Let's find out. Alright, so now I gotta go talk to Anemone. Well, we finally got that mission done at least, which is good. That's the valley thing. Camp development, I do want to go and do that. We have two missions to hit up there, and we need to get whatever that is. Which I assume is probably a mission. Still need to do stamp collecting, and we need to do this. Alright, we got quite a few things to do. That's where I gotta talk to Anemone. Lone Wolf, what is this? Is this a mission that I need to try and get to or not? Let me know, please. I assume that's like a waypoint or something I get to later in the game, but... I'm nervous about missing missions. I don't want to miss any. I think I've already missed one, which sucks, but I think it was only that one. Terminal repairs. Robo Dojo Black Belt. I don't want to mess with you right now. What the heck is a meals item shop? That's disgusting. Let's go right here. We can make our way there from here pretty quick. Pretty sure that's the, uh... They're messing with the teleporter, and I have to break it so I can start teleporting to it again. Or break them so I can start teleporting to it again. What's up, punks? Time to die. I don't know how you all dodged my attacks for that long, to be honest. Very good at backstepping. Free money, free experience. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, the level up bar in this game is really weird. I can never, like, tell how close or far away I am from leveling up. 